Welcome back to the channel Moda Family and today we have ourselves an interesting topic, a very very interesting topic at that. And this is a question that almost everyone actively in the crypto world has asked themselves. And different people have tried to answer it differently but we are giving you our approach to this question. When is altcoin season starting? When will the altcoin pumps start? And this is what almost every altcoin investor has been waiting for for those you know 10x 100x gains and best of you know research every credible investor has their own analysis right now this video is bringing you some of that research such that you can best understand when altcoin season will start or at least around which time frame we believe and before we get into anything before we get into um, any of this Data, this is not financial advice in any way and all investment decisions made will be made at your own risk and ensure to do your own research. Make sure that you do your own research and this again is not financial advice. So to get straight into it, something very interesting has been happening. 75% of all Bitcoin has not moved in six months. Now, for those that you know typically know about altcoins, altcoins typically follow Bitcoin. The Bitcoin price movement. Once Bitcoin moves, pumps, altcoins pump. Once Bitcoin, once Bitcoin dumps, altcoins dump. And Bitcoin is the measure that should tell you when the next altcoin season is. So the yardstick to look at is Bitcoin. And 95% of all Bitcoin hasn't moved. Now, take this into account that at the top of all cycles, people start selling, which means, you know, for the most part, people that are having Bitcoin will sell it. And we will notice that the Bitcoin that has been held, it wouldn't be, you know, at, at certain significant levels. But all holders are holding. Most holders are holding. And 75% of Bitcoin hasn't moved in six months. Look at where the big money is. You will tell where the market is going. I've, I've mentioned that before in this channel, right? And wallets holding between 100 to 1,000 Bitcoin have accumulated an additional 100,000 Bitcoin in the last six weeks, which means that 10 to 100x more Bitcoin has been purchased, has been accumulated by some of the whales, the, the institutions in the crypto world. Hmm, what is going on? In the last six weeks, Bitcoin accumulation has grown by 10 to 100x. I mean, what is going on? And all this is leading to something. It's leading to a certain end goal. And this is probably... Uh, something that the average crypto investor might not know, you know. Um, this is no coincidence at all. Six billion worth, six billion dollars worth of Bitcoin has been accumulated in the past six weeks by, you know, the biggest um, wallets or the whale wallets. Hmm. Okay. Well, what is going on? Not only is that a big deal, but 60% of the top US hedge funds now hold Bitcoin ETFs, which means the largest financial institutions are now holding Bitcoin exchange traded funds. What is going on? We're seeing institutions adopting Bitcoin. Previously, which was the risky asset to hold previously it was that kind of uh, um, asset for scammers and unpredictable but now we're seeing the largest percentage of u.s hedge funds holding bitcoin and we all know that you know the u.s is you know the financial superpower of the world when you speak about wall street right and 60 percent of these hedge funds are holding bitcoin Goldman Sachs is the leading global asset manager. It has assets under it worth more than $2 trillion. Now, the leading global assets manager, hmm, having more than $418 million worth of Bitcoin ETFs. 
this is one of the largest financial institutions this is one of the institutions actually that is supporting blackrock's mission to you know um, tokenize the financial world what is going on again and just bring it to you data for you to best understand when is old coin season setting and when is the right time for you to actually start putting in money because the rule is you need to buy low sell high you wouldn't want to buy when old coin season has already started pumping you would want to buy before it starts so we're seeing institutions buying bitcoin we're seeing governments we're seeing states yeah the state of wisconsin buys nearly a hundred million dollars worth of blackrock spotty bitcoin etf now this is a state buying a hundred million dollars worth of bitcoin etfs and we're seeing you know countries and countries and states and more than just the state of wisconsin nations are holding bitcoin as in holding it not selling the asset remember that 75 percent of all bitcoin has not moved in the last six months and institutions are also acquiring more to hold hold it's crazy now bitcoin has been more or less consolidating of course it had its you know time where it was correcting it, it dumped really hard but it has been more or less consolidating and we are seeing also that uh, the former ceo of bitmex um, arthur hayes believes that all coins won't see a resurge until bitcoin surpasses seventy thousand and ethereum the four thousand dollar mark and arthur is a very well-known person in the you know crypto space he believes that bitcoin upon surpassing seventy thousand and ethereum upon surpassing the four thousand dollar mark we shall see altcoins starting to rally up and pump again. Now, remember that we are having more than, you know, 75% of all Bitcoin being held. We are having wells buying and buying more Bitcoin, at least 10 to 100x more Bitcoin than they hold. We are seeing some of the largest financial institutions holding, holding Bitcoin ETFs. The largest financial institutions, governments, states holding Bitcoin ETFs. And this is all happening before the election. The Trump election, the Donald Trump election. Now, we have been seeing a lot happening with Donald Trump. He has been, you know, the most spoken of person in the past five months. And it's because of, of course, you know, controversies around him, but also specifically in the bitcoin narrative and the crypto narrative his support for officially legitimizing crypto and bitcoin in the states and he says that the future of crypto will be built in the united states therefore how is this adding up are you seeing a string that is adding together all these you know points and trump according to speculation anyway the trump election could drive bitcoin's price to you know at least eighty-five thousand dollars, and this is happening in the next two months right and of course one thing um is speculated that you know the, the, the trump election is going to pump the crypto price over now, once Trump is elected, we're going to see more institutions, of course, getting into the crypto world. We're going to see more banks. We're going to see more um, governments, more countries getting into the crypto space, seeing that the U.S. is sort of like a leading country in most things. So when the U.S. decides to use Bitcoin as a reserve currency as well, we shall see the world adopting. But how come <clears throat> that institutions are holding, whales are buying, Bitcoin is being held, it's not moving, that should tell you one thing that we are in the stage where which is leading up to the next pump the next old coin season the next bull run significant pump because once it happens we definitely will not see you know over 75 percent of bitcoin not moving wallets will sell the the way to know that you know old coin season has come the bull run has officially come is when you see 
buy orders and sell orders significantly you know rising so we're going to see that you know wallets will sell we will, may not see as a big percentage of holders of the bitcoin asset as we do see right now which means the right now is the best time to buy if that's your question when is the best time to buy right now right now now of course the are integrities of okay what is the right entry point which is the best price to enter at well do your own research and you should have personal price targets but i can tell you one thing for sure is the dots in the bitcoin ecosystem are leading up to a very very close old coin season a very close old coin season and they're all speaking loud towards that effect and so we know very well that soon upon donald trump's election and this is speculation we could see a significant pump from that point forth but when we start to see well selling then we know that the market is going to crash then we know that we're in that you know phase of the bull run where people are taking profits but when we see wells buying we should understand that something is about to happen so again this is not financial advice please do your own research and thank you for staying to this point of the video for those that haven't yet done so please hit the subscribe button you will get notified when we upload any new video in fact you will be the first person to know that we have uploaded a new video don't hesitate and don't forget to like leave a comment down below on what you think about um, the old coin seasons and when it's starting and share the video to anyone you think it will be of value to till the next time cheers